Hey guys, so today I want to take a quick little look here at Minecraft Pocket Edition for Android, of course, uh, on this LG Optimus G smartphone, which is actually one of my favorite smartphones right now that uh, I have my hands on right now, but of course, more phones is coming up. So, of course, this is a game that's been out for quite some time now, but it's been very successful, so I thought I'd do a quick another video here on it. So first of all, you do have join games, and I suppose that's only for uh, people in your home network. So if I I'm, I'm, I might be able to uh, try to use this uh, with my Wi-Fi network on more of my Android smartphones and try it out how that works. But I think I already done so. Uh, but you do have the simple you know first options tabs with uh, some quick settings here. Uh, but let's just try to play the game <clears throat> so you do uh, see my old world here I can just simply create a new one over here and then we do have two different modes use this in normal Minecraft mode survive mode of course uh, it will feature mobs uh, health gather resources uh, while creative is unlimited resources and flying so start off with um, let's start off with this one a little bit more of a creative one first. So of course in the creative one you are just running around here with unlimited resources and I can jump. I can also they have you know optimized controls here so it's very very easy to move around however you want. And let's see if I want to fly. Maybe there we go. So I can go up like this, and then I can fly around like a maniac. But of course, the goal with the creative mode here is let's see if we can go down. Of course, the creative mode we do have unlimited resources. So if we want to go down again, we can. And then we do have things like, oops, go down. Remember that you don't have to think about jump. And uh, no, do you have to jump? Maybe. Huh. Okay. Let's go down. So of course we can build something over here by just tapping wherever we want to you know place the blocks of course it's easier to do this with a bigger display like the galaxy note or an optimus g pro uh, even though this display is also fairly fairly big of course we can also remove blocks very very easy is by holding in and you know it will remove the blocks and i also will provide a link in the if you want to you know, download this game. Uh, we do have other things like bricks. So we can build a brick house. Of course, very, very nice brick house, you know, it's the good stuff. Some people in Minecraft just like to build some other, they do like the creative mode a little bit more. And uh, you know the creative mode is where you will have to you can actually die in, in the creative mode and that's something that could be good to know. If you don't want to die, you should probably not uh, play the creative mode. Let's see if we can go back here, quit to title. Let's start a game, create a new one and let's go with survival mode. And I mean, of course this is good if you have friends at home something and uh, you wanna hook up everyone to the same Wi-Fi network. I suppose you can play the same survival uh, with mobs and stuff. That is something that uh, would probably be kind of cool. You can see here at least in survival that it auto jumps when I run. And let's see, we need to gather some resources, I suppose, to, you know, build. I suppose it will work kind of the same as in normal Minecraft. Here we go. Let's go up, go up, go up. 
Now when we tap here, hmm, how do we do this? Okay, so we do have the resource wood right now. How do you build something? Hmm. Where do they have like the crafting area? Hmm, interesting. I mean like I can't remember how it works in the pocket edition of Minecraft. Because I mean I can't tap on something to do this. I, I just have wood. Oh there we go, craft. Okay, so you can simply go into craft here and uh, you can see uh, that I can do like a crafting table when I have four wooden planks right now. And of course they have optimized the crafting table here so it will be easier for for doing it on a smartphone. So we can place that one right there and then we can quickly access this area and uh, we can, you know, of course, as in normal Minecraft, you can do arrows, your bows, diamond axe, uh, bread, diamond boots, like everything here. Yeah, block of diamond, block of gold, block of iron. I mean, you have everything in here. Uh, so definitely fun uh, for all of the normal Minecraft users. You don't have any glitches or anything weird. Uh, the game is, seems to be running fine here. So I definitely would recommend this game. Uh, Maybe a little bit expensive though, uh, but I mean, like, if you, if you are really passionate to Minecraft, then I mean, of course, it won't be. If you're gonna play this game every day on your phone, uh, it it won't be a high price. And uh, some people also been asking me about the Ultimate G that it's getting warm, you know, during a long time of playing uh, games, and I want to check out that a little bit more. Uh, so yeah, just quickly a video here, checking it out here on the amazing Optimus G smartphone. So I do hope you did enjoy that. If you want to check out the game, you can uh, check out the description of this video. So until next time, just have a good day and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.